computer starting design is a delicate balance between performance and budget limitations. My name is Lorenzo DeMasso with ABB. Let's talk about soft starters and drives. Today we're going to explain the difference between the two and answer some frequently asked questions. The two major differences between a soft starter and a drive is a soft starter is a reduced voltage starter and it can only be applied on constant speed applications. A VFD, not only can it be a reduced voltage starter, but it can also control the speed of the motor. Now how do you decide which one to use, a soft starter or a drive? In applications where you need to control the speed and the torque of the motor while running, a VFD must be used. In applications where you're simply trying to reduce the wear and tear, the torque shock, the initial voltage, while starting the motor, a soft starter can be used. In today's marketplace, there are two types of soft start. There's a three-phase regulated soft start, which basically regulates all three legs while starting and stopping the motor. And then we have the two-phase soft start, basically regulating two out of the three legs feeding the motor, whereby the third leg is tied directly to the motor. In the past, this type of technology was unaccepted because of the distortion and the imbalance of current and voltage while ramping the motor up. With today's technology, the problems associated with single phase regulation is in the past. We can eliminate the current and voltage imbalances associated with single phase regulation, whereby a single phase regulated soft starter mimics a three phase regulated soft starter. As you can see, there are differences between soft starters and drives and the applications on when to use them. My name is Lorenzo DeMasso with ABB.